Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to use the My Customers app. And I just love this tool so much. You can just do a whole bunch of different things with your business. And I hope you guys like it and it's beneficial for you. There's a whole bunch of different options on there, so I'm going to be showing you guys step on step on how to use it. So let's get started. All right guys, so here is the My Customers app. Once you've downloaded the app, you're going to use your ID number and then you're going to have a password with that. Right now I use my thumbprint, which is, which is very easy to use. So once you go ahead and let that refresh, on the bottom right corner, you're going to see that add symbol. And there's going to be a whole bunch of icons that are going to show up. We're going to use the MK shopping icon first. And this is if you want to... Um, have somebody with a product so you're going to click on the individual's name and you're going to choose whether it's cds or from your inventory you're going to choose the product that they would like and once you've clicked that you go ahead and add if they want one or two whatever they would like and you go into the top right corner again and then you're going to click that you're going to go to where it says total and that already does the taxes and everything for that. If you want to adjust it, you can. Also, if you want a discount for that, you can choose whether it's zero to 100% discount if you choose, or you can put the amount. Once you're done with that, you're gonna to go to the payment option. And this is where they can give you a credit card, a cash, or a check payment. And once you're done with that, you can go ahead and put that in. And then once you're done, you can go back to the top and you go into press delivered and then mark as complete. When you go back to the home screen now, we're going to go to my inventory. And this is where you can see your whole inventory that you have at home. Um, you can also click on a product that you have at home and you can um, put more that you have on hand or you can just delete something if you do not have that on hand anymore. Then you go back to the home screen and you're going to go to your customers. Now this is where you're going to add a contact. So you put the first and the last name. And this is also where you can put their phone number, their email, their address. And this is where you can communicate through message, through calling, or you can also send a sales ticket receipt through them. And you can also put your notes just so you can better um, so you have you, you have any questions like if it's a neighbor or if it's somebody from the school, just so you can um, remember, remember that customer from where you met them. And then once you're done with that, you can go back to the home screen. And then I'm going to talk to you guys about the catalog. This is so that you know any product details. So if somebody asks you um, anything about the product and you just want to um, um, refresh your memory, then you can do so here. Um, so that is that for the product details. You're not going to click on the my six things and this is where you can add any quotes that you like to just inspire you every single day and that's our my, those are my six things that I um, have written down. So we're going to click on the reports and this is a great tool to use whenever you're counting your inventory for the end of the month um, or just inventory for the year as well. This is a great tool also to use whenever you're doing your taxes. You're going to choose whether you want to do in PDF form or in spreadsheet form. And then you can go ahead and run the report. At the top right where you see the camera icon, you're going to go ahead and click on that. And this is the barcode scanner. So whenever you have a Mary Kay order coming in through UPS, you can just scan the barcode that it has there. And then it will automatically upload everything into your inventory without you having to do one by one. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. If you guys have any questions or any comments, just comment down below and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.